Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Today, I want to talk about the Los Angeles Lakers and their impressive offseason so far. They have made some smart moves that go beyond simply acquiring talented players. Unlike other teams, the Lakers haven't overpaid for anyone, and they have managed to maintain their quality depth by keeping all of their key role players. This team has also become bigger and more massive, with the smallest guy on the roster being 6 feet 3 inches. Everyone else is 6 feet 5 inches or taller, making the Lakers a truly imposing and versatile team. They have incredible switchability and depth in every position, from the guards to the front court and wing players. It's hard to argue against the Lakers being the deepest team in the league. However, their offseason is not over yet. The Lakers still have a couple of roster spots open and are actively looking to add another center. There's speculation about potentially bringing back Malik Beasley or signing a veteran big man who can provide physicality and experience. And the name of Heman Gomez or Willie appears in a possible negotiation soon if the Boston Celtics do not close the negotiation. The Lakers also need to address their scoring needs. While they have some promising options, having a reliable bucket getter and a consistent scorer could greatly benefit the team, especially in closing out games. I want to hear your thoughts on this. Do you think the Lakers have done a fantastic job in the offseason? Do they need to add another center and a proven scorer? Share your opinions in the comments below. Let's have a discussion and see what the Lakers still need to do to be a dominant force in the upcoming season. And here's a tip from the Los Angeles Lakers News Top Channel, study financial education and have a better quality of life, in the financial market, studying real estate investment trust REITs and stocks responsibly for passive income, even more. 